Hi there and welcome to day three of Right to the End with me, Maria Franklin, and we're here for another uh, writing prompt uh, for this November writing challenge. Uh, so thank you uh, for all the, the likes you've been putting on the videos so far and welcome to the, the new followers that have joined as well. It's, it's great to have you here. Uh, and if you haven't already, you can join my Keep In Touch list to be kept notified of future uh, mini courses like this one by visiting my website mariafranklin.co.uk where you'll also get a free booklet uh, on making yourself a better writer than you are already which is exciting stuff okay so without further ado let's get on to today's writing prompt uh, which is where is my notebook um, so the theme is endings and today's theme on endings um, is, is one that we thought might have happened by now but hasn't. Uh, so I want you to write on the theme of the end of the pandemic. Okay, whatever that means to you, the end of the pandemic. Uh, so there's lots of different uh, approaches to this. Um, you could write in anticipation of the end of the, the pandemic. Um, you could write uh, by visualisation of the actual end of the pandemic, if, if it's ever declared. You could write as though you're reflecting on the, the end of the pandemic. So you could really go out into the future and uh, write, write the whole thing as a reflection. Um, and I guess what will have the, um, the appeal uh, in this writing that you're about to do is that, that universal um, nature of it, the fact that every single person will be be able to relate uh, to what you're writing so I'm really excited to see some of these responses in the the Facebook group uh, writerly witterings so search for writerly witterings if you would like to join and you haven't already um, so yes at the end of the pandemic it means different things to different people so it's it, this could be a time to reflect on how it's changed you uh, during uh, the pandemic but keep that focus uh, on on the the ending so as always you might want to do a little bit of planning around this give yourself a little space because it's quite broad and um, to to really narrow in on an on an aspect of what you're going to write about and as with all my prompts you can approach this in a poetic way um, you can write a short story, uh, a piece of flash fiction. Um, you can write from real life from your own perspective or this could be a uh, fictional so that you've got lots of uh, freedom and scope with that but this the these few words will mean something to everybody there has been nobody untouched by this so that your prompt for today the end of the pandemic and i'll see you tomorrow same time same place bye for now <laughs>